I actually, kind of by accident, I had to teach myself to cook in college because I moved out of the school dorms and I had to feed myself. So I taught myself by reading cookbooks. I had vision at the time and then it kind of took off from there because I really enjoyed cooking and, and feeding other people. I think cooking is a way to share myself with other people and it's to show people how, that I care about them and it's a way to communicate because we all have to eat. So food is very representative of one's culture and where they come from and their background. So for me, it's, a, it's like a language. Uh, my cooking style, I do what we call comfort food. So it's food that I grew up eating that I, um, love to eat as it's a memory of my childhood so I like to cook that sort of food from all over the world as well so I always travel and ask people you know what sort of thing do you love to eat on a daily basis or what do you miss about um, your um, own family's cooking and that's the kind of food that I like to incorporate into my own style of cooking. Uh, to cook, I actually don't have a single favorite dish. I think I'm happiest in the kitchen when I'm cooking something that's new that I've never cooked before because I think uh, as someone, as a chef, you're always trying to learn new things. So I'm always excited to try new ingredients and new techniques in the kitchen. Uh, in the kitchen is actually cooking food that uh, pleases my husband. <laughs> it's the biggest challenge. He's actually uh, harder than Gordon Ramsay sometimes on me. <laughs> but it makes me a better cook. I feel like presentation is important, but for me, I don't really care so much how a, a dish looks. But that doesn't mean that I shouldn't care for other people because other people do have vision. So I think that for me, it's more important how uh, food feels and tastes in your mouth. So that's where I concentrate uh, most of my work is how um, food makes you feel when you take your first bite. I think you have to stay true to yourself and have integrity when you cook, but at the same time, you need to know your audience. You can't always please everybody, but you have to think about who's eating your food. And then I think there's always a way to balance both. I think outside of the kitchen, a fun person. I enjoy life. I uh, love meeting new people, learning about other people, and learning about other people's cultures. I like to, uh, you know, hang out with friends, meet new friends, and just enjoy life. <laughs>